Have you ever wondered about the first stars of the universe? Let's embark on a cosmic journey back to the beginning of it all, the Big Bang. This explosive event set the stage for the birth of the universe, spewing forth a primordial soup of particles that would eventually coalesce into the first stars. Known as Population 3, or Pop 3 stars, these celestial pioneers were composed mainly of hydrogen and helium. Their properties were quite unlike the stars we're familiar with today. Imagine stars of tremendous heat, so gigantic in size and mass that they dwarf our own sun, yet they lived fast and died young. Their short but dramatic lifespan was a stark contrast to the billions of years our sun is expected to shine. These celestial giants, although elusive, left behind a legacy that continues to shape the universe as we know it. So, why are these first-generation stars so important, you may wonder? Well, these pioneering stars, known as Pop 3 stars, played a monumental role in the universe as we know it. Primarily composed of hydrogen and helium, these celestial giants were the first to synthesize most elements heavier than helium. Acting as cosmic alchemists, they forged the very building blocks of our universe, setting the stage for the formation of later generations of stars and galaxies. Their nuclear furnaces birthed elements that make up our planets, even us, Yet these stars are elusive. They existed in the early universe, far away, and way too faint for our current telescopes to detect. Their light has traveled over 13 billion years to reach us, diluted and faded with distance. Despite their fleeting existence, Pop 3 stars have left an indelible mark on the cosmos, a legacy we're still trying to decipher. But how can we uncover evidence of these ancient celestial bodies? Here's where the fascinating allure of black holes comes into play. Researchers have developed a method to detect the first stars of the universe by observing the unique flares produced when these stars are torn apart by black holes. It's as if the black holes are cosmic detectives, revealing clues about these primordial stars. When a POP3 star gets too close to a black hole, it's stretched and torn apart in a process known as spaghettification. This violent event creates a flare that can be observed from great distances. By tracking these flares, we can potentially identify the remnants of the first stars. NASA's latest telescopes, with their ability to observe the resultant infrared emissions, are aiding in this search. These findings could allow us to understand more about the early universe, shedding light on how the first stars formed and evolved. Through the destructive power of black holes, we found a way to uncover the secrets of the universe's first stars. What does this mean for our understanding of the early universe? Well, the potential of this research method is immense. It could provide new insights about the early universe, a time that has remained largely a mystery to us. The first stars, those ancient behemoths of hydrogen and helium, might not be as elusive as we thought. This method offers a promising future for the field of cosmic archaeology. By observing the unique flares produced when these stars are torn apart by black holes, we can detect the faint echoes of the universe's first light. NASA's latest telescopes are stepping up to the challenge. Equipped to observe the resultant infrared emissions, they're our eyes into the past, helping us trace the lineage of the stars and galaxies that make up our universe today. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos, we inch closer to understanding our own place in the grand tapestry of the universe.